Well, I'm Bobby. And I'm Billy. And today we're opening up really old stuff. We're opening up some crazy bones from the 90s, or early 2000s, rather. This is, this is the second set, Things, the one with the aliens. Yeah, this is supposed to be my favorite set because they, they painted some of them. So some of them look really, really, really... Uh, they look a lot better than the other ones because they've been painted. Yeah, they look a lot better. That's a good way of explaining it. They definitely look a lot better. Well, I'm not the expert here. Here, Here's the book. We have the official handbook. This is what an alien looks like. They did come out with packs later on that were only aliens, I think. So I hope maybe there's some uh, exclusive aliens in this set. I yeah. hope at least... We're going to open up five of these packs today, I think. Five of these packs, yeah. If that's okay with you, Bobby. That's, that's fine with me. They're very old, so we want to keep two for our collection. You can hear my dog crying in the background out of pure excitement for these crazy bones. Yes, we are very excited too, except we are a little bit older. <laughs> yeah, Billy's going to go deal with the puppy right now, and then we're going to crack open five of these packs. All right. All right, we're back now that the dog's whining slightly less. I found two packs of the five that I noticed had slight differences in the art. I mean, around the things right here, there's a little more of a splash, a more of an accent, a more of a comic booky font but there's something I didn't notice until today the bottom left of this one here says magic box international and I do know that crazy ones were popular in other parts in the world and actually had different names because I had a book no I had a friend who had a book that had different names than what were in mine so I have the official handbook it is and I mean official for my area or whatever big box store I bought it at but you can find the names of all the crazy bones in here. And then some of them come, came with stickers. <sighs> you'd fill. Let's see if I can find something that has a sticker. See right here? Yeah. And do the stickers come in the packs? The stickers come in the packs alongside the crazy bones. So it was a lot of fun to fill your, fill your book. I mean, I remember collecting my stickers as a kid, so I, I don't even remember how... This is actually my original handbook from when I was a kid. Mm -hmm. So I don't even remember how a lot of these stickers got in there because I, I stacked mine up and collected them. I was more of a collector than a hmm. sticker. -er 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 -er. So so these two packs, the difference is like is the, like why? This is an inter international pack, I noticed. So maybe there's... We'll have to... Let's crack into these two first uh -huh. and see if we can notice any differences. So okay. we'll open the one on the left by tradition let's open the international pack first okay well this is bobby's gonna open it for us and we're gonna see let's hope for an alien let's go one by one original crazy bones pack from the things international let's get her going uh -oh. i've never actually opened one of these personally so wow this must be uh, exciting for you <laughs> start with the international pack okay so should i pull out all the card and the stickers first or should i pull up the bone Bones. Whatever you want. Okay, here comes the... I'm going to leave the bones in there and pull out all this stuff first. Alright, so there's the stickers. So it comes with four stickers. That's pretty cool. Alright. Awesome. This set was called Things, because there's things in them. Like light bulbs, doors, pebbles. <laughs> Here's like a game card where it teaches you how to play a game with them. Yeah, that's another thing. I know each pack came with a game card, so you only got the rules to one game card. There's a little checklist on the other side. That's pretty cool. So you cool. got the rules to one game. I know the book has the rules to mm -hmm. each game. They seem like a good company that's putting in, like, trying to... Magic box, I believe. The okay. back of the crazy one. Here comes the first ball. Screw top, I think. I don't think that's Screw Sob. I think that his name is Corkscrew. Let's oh. come up with our own names. Because there I, is I a corkscrew on the bottom, or a cork on the bottom there. I'm huh? pretty sure it's corkscrew. Okay, well, that's Feel cool. free to comment in the comment box below what the actual names are of things. We don't really, we're not going to look up each crazy <laughs> bone. Maybe we get them right. Maybe oh. you have a funnier name. That's a cool color. I've, I don't remember if I've seen one that color before. Oh, that's a, that's drum set. He does look like a drum set. Did you just come up with that, or is that the actual name? Yeah, that's an orange one. I can, <laughs> I can tell by the color. <laughs> Okay, number three. Oh, like a Ooh. clear one? It's like a pencil? It is a pencil. Cool. That's really cool. Yeah. It's kind of sad, though. That pencil's almost run out. So I think there's only one bone left in this pack. This, is this the alien? Or is it not? Oh, no aliens in this pack. 
We got a purple light bulb. Exciting. Awesome. Let's see if we do any better with the next pack. So this is the one that has the choking hazard on it. <laughs> does the other pack not have a choking hazard? It does not. All right, so they were a little more lax about the safety with the international <laughs> ones. What does that say? I don't know what that says. Let us know if you personally ever choked on a crazy bone and know someone who has. <laughs> they seem like they seem like they're they kind of look like candy actually. That's not good. <laughs> I remember one time Bobby recommended to me that they should have crazy bone candy actually. And, <laughs> and then he quickly told me that that is a horrible idea. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wow, this looks old. Look at the paper it's on. Mhm. Mm and they they look uh Look, it has they have uh on the stickers. It says you a magic box international. And look, these are the this is, these are the stickers from the other pack and these are the stickers from the new pack. Like that's the same sticker art but on different paper. Wait, are you did, which one came from this pack? Uh this one. Interesting cuz look, the stickers say magic box international on these stickers, but the one the, the pack said international, they don't say it on the stickers, mm -hmm. so and then this one comes with a big card in it that says Happy Book. Oh, so Happy Book. Instead of a game card. Or it does have game on it. Interesting. Okay, that's cool. Okay, let's put these aside. And let's get into this. We got first. Oh! There we go. Very nice. <laughs> oh, Very nice. Amazing. A solid color alien. Mm -hmm. And this is one of the ones I was telling you about off camera, Bobby, where there's different color paint on it. I, I really like those. So they got the, the torches painted red. That's very nice. Oh, like Statue, Statue of Liberty. It's amazing. Since I don't think we have that ones. in our collection yet either. No, this is new to me. It's very beautiful. Yeah, put, put that right there. Put that off to the side by itself. Look at that. Cool. So we're one for two. Let's uh, finish off this pack. Do you know if it's possible to get two aliens in one pack? I actually think I remember doing that as a kid once. Well, That'd be exciting. We can only hope. Oh, that's a cool one. It's like a washing machine. I really love how all the colors are so different. They use a lot of different plastic. Oh, sweet. Solid hot it's, pink. It's always surprising when you pull it out because it's like always something way different than the See, other that, one. I think that's Happy Book's cousin, Sad Pillowcase. He looks a little disturbed. <laughs> yeah, he looks like somebody just woke him up with a pail of water or something. He's like, oh, crap. Oh, I can't focus. <laughs> all right, last one in the pack. And you can probably all tell what that one is. Lamp. Well made, that one. Awesome. All right. So the third pack we're going to open. Next pack. All right, on to the third pack. So far, I'm happy. Aliens are always exciting. They're always really different. I w Do you know if like this alien can come in a different color? They come in all sorts of different colors. The eyes actually glow in the dark. The first set had completely glow in the dark crazy bones as well. This set, I don't think there's any regular crazy bones that glow in the dark, but the alien's eyes do. Okay, so these are the stickers. Again, looking very old. And then we got the cutter. Cutter. Nice. It's got eyes on the... <laughs> it's good art. Awesome, okay. Open this one up upside down. Another pencil, but in a different color. Mm. Neon green. I Neon prefer this one. Pencil. I think. Nice. Put that one right by the other one. It kind of looks like candy floss color. Ooh, I think that's a safe. You should hold it a little further back, Bobby. There we go. Easier to focus. I'm just hoping they get all the details. All the excellent details. You can see all the bubbles inside of the see through ones. <laughs> oh, cool. Another. It's a different shade of orange than the other orange one we got. Oh, and then uh, 
a lampshade. A see-through lampshade, very nice. Awesome. So we are getting doubles, but they're different colors. That's nice. Is that the last one in the pack? Yes, I think that was four. All right, so that's the third pack. We're one for three with the aliens. So next I think pack. this is pack number four. We're going to open another international pack instead of one of the ones with the choking hazards. Well, the ones with the choking hazards said international on the stickers inside, so they're really all international. Yeah, they just I didn't were, notice that. They were printed at different times. Okay. I mentioned it at least three times in the video. <laughs> Mention in the comments if you noticed that Bobby missed that over and over. Alright, so that's a big eggplant guy. I wonder if this one has a picture on it. No. Checklist. It's a tra tra traditional checklist. Looks like a bingo. This looks like a bingo. It looks like a bingo card. Oh, wow. That's a cool looking alien. Elvis. He's an Elvis impersonator from outer space. An extraterrestrial lady loving guy. guy. Whoa. <laughs> check, out, <laughs> check out the red paint on his head too, like the other one. I like that. Absolutely awesome. And it's not as shiny as the other, the rest of the bone, so it's kind of like he has matte paint on him too. Awesome. Really? He's like the kid who Voldemort tried to kill, but then he got a scar. Harry Potter or something. <laughs> There we go. So, the Elvis Harry Potter from Outer Space, extraterrestrial, <laughs> Voldemort swaying guy. <laughs> Very nice. Alright, bone number three. Looks like Ooh, a street light. Now, that's a nice one. And that's a different shade of blue from the other see through blue one we got. I don't think we've gotten one or, um,. One set of duplicate colors. They're, each one of these crazy bones is a different color. Mm. I wonder if they use just scrap plastic. Like if they... I, I don't know. I love it. I haven't seen any like gray bones though. Or like really gross looking colors. So... <laughs> hmm. Well, that one's kind of a gross color. <laughs> yeah, now that... <laughs> it's like a smoky see-through. Ah, interesting. The chest of drawers. <laughs> All right. Awesome. So, was that the fifth pack? Oh, there's another. There's two more bones in here. There's two more? Yeah, how many bones did we pull out of there? I think three, right? I'm not sure. <laughs> I think... I think Mention in the comments how, uh, how much Bobby is letting slip by him in this video. And, and there's only one bone left in here. It's just really long. <laughs> it felt like two bones inside. Yeah, you know what? Sometimes two bone subs feel like one when it's really long. Yeah. And, okay, so that's an excited... <laughs> awesome. I don't know what that is. It's like a cookie jar. What if... You can't fit your hand right down in the bottom. Yeah. Sometimes with the long bones, you can't fit your hand right down in the bottom. Alright, so pack number five coming up. Pack number five, really? Okay, yep. so we're at about a 50% success rate. Let's see if we can break that with this fifth pack. I wonder if that's regular. Like if we're doing really good or we have no clue. Well, there is other Crazy Bone videos on this channel of me, myself, mm -hmm. about three or four years ago. I opened up packs and I had a great success rate. Almost 100%. So go check out those videos of uh, a younger Billy opening up some Crazy Bones and having a really good time with it. Well, it seems like uh, whoever did the art for this just had a kid and he's thinking about baby bottles because that looks a lot like the nipple for a baby bottle. <laughs> a sombrero. Hmm. I wonder if they transferred the art over from other projects because that doesn't look much like a sombrero to Not me. Not at all. Interesting. Okay. And then there's another card in here too, obviously. Whoa, these stickers are... You only got two? Or they're cut apart? Yeah, they're cut apart. Hmm. Not much consistency with the, with the packs. Yeah, and the paper looks different colors too. Interesting. I don't know if you can see that, but it's like, I don't know. I wonder how much deep attention they paid when they were. A thousand kilogram weight, I believe that is. Let's see if we can focus. Ooh, okay. Awesome. Nice. This one feels good. 
Oh my goodness. <laughs> it is a solid yellow panda. Oh. I know Bobby really likes the solid yellow, so that's got to be his alien right it's, there. It's my favorite. And we're working with the same color scheme. That which... can go... Actually, both those are kind of yellow, so those can both go in your personal collection. Well, that one's kind of green. All right, we're going to have to fight over that one. We're going to have to play a game of bones for them. We'll take it out backyard and we'll... We're going to have to bone. Take we're going to have Yep. All right. Oh, there's the toilet. Hmm. Dark green toilet. I like the color of that toilet. Still no real color duplicates. Lots of fun. All right, last one. Ooh, shape. there it is. Another neon. We have another neon green one right there. But they're different. They're different colors. They are slightly different. I don't know if the camera really picks up on the differences, but... Yeah, five packs, three with aliens. So that's that seems really good. I'm very happy. <laughs> I'm definitely happy. So do you have a lot of fun today, Bobby, opening these? Oh, I'm having tons of fun with these things. I... I remember them from childhood. There's tons of nostalgia. And I, I remember, I didn't, I don't remember these from, like, I only remember we had a few. So they're always new. That's what I love about them. Every time we pull one out, they're different. That is, that was always the part of the fun with Crazy Bones. So on this channel, if you know about YouTube's new policy, we're trying to reach a thousand subscribers. We don't know if we're going to do it next week, next month, or years from now. But we're going to keep putting out videos. We're going to stay consistent, and we're going to start doing our giveaways a little bit different. We're willing to give away almost anything we open on this channel. If we see a funny comment or someone, you know, stands out to us in the crowd. So, let's start. We'll always mention them in the video after. Definitely, we're going we're gonna to mention their names. We're, yeah. try, we're trying to make this channel subscription-based, subscriber-based. Mm -hmm. If you want to see us open something on this channel, let us know. Because it's likely we're going to do it. We don't have that many subscribers right now. Mm -hmm. But let's grow this. Let's grow this channel and have a lot of fun along the way. So Give us, give us ideas. Comment down below because we're always open to new things. We'll, we'll open pretty much everything and have a great time. So until next time, this is Bobby and Billy signing out. See ya.